My name is Anastasia Rolox. I am 24 years old and I am from Grove, Golden Grove, East Bank, Bemar. I am here in relation to a case that I have pending with NIS. Um, on the 26th of December 2022, I was admitted to the St. Joseph Marcy's Hospital for an emergency C-section. Um, on the 27th of December 2022, I was discharged. Subsequently, in January, I would have submitted my claims for maternity benefit as well as the hospital medical bill to NIS. Um, in February, I was informed via mail that my claim has been denied due to some missing record of contributions. Um, I was advised to go to my previous place of work to receive a letter stating the period which, for which they would have been um, giving contributions for me. This was done on February 28th. It was submitted to NIS, the Records Department, on February 28th of 2023. One month after that, I was approved for my maternity benefit. I spoke with the receptionist at NIS who advised me to file an appeal for the medical expenses. I did so in March of 2023. Then following month, I decided to follow up with the appeals clerk and I was told that my appeal is still being processed. I was told that this process usually takes months, sometimes years. Um, after that, I would visit NIS every month to follow up on my appeal process. And until recently, this year, 2024, um, I would have been told in May that the appeal came down, the, my file came down from the compliance department to the appeal clerk, but there was a mistake. And so she had to send it up back to the compliance department. I gave them a month, I revisited in June, and the appeal clerk told me, of course, it was still not returned to her. And so she sent me up to the inspector in the compliance department for Georgetown. I spoke to the in, in, inspector who didn't give me a reason as to why my appeal was taking so long, but he gave me a number to check up on the appeal. Um, I messaged him a week after I visited and no response. To date, I haven't received any response from the inspector or have I been able to get on to NIS via phone. My concern is that I would have been approved for my maternity benefit contributions. I would have received the maternity benefits and so I assumed that because I would have been approved for that, then it would trigger an automatic approval for my medical expenses. However, that has not been the case, and I have been visiting the NIS, Camp Street branch, for months, and no one has given me a specific reason as to why my case is being delayed. All I'm being told is that it usually takes months, sometimes years. The appeal clerk even told me, um, that sometimes you forget about it and then they call you. I just want my case to be looked at and I'm hoping that going forward, uh, the individual responsible for seeing these processes through ensures that no other citizen or no other contributor, no other member of the national insurance scheme has to wait over a year for their um, refunds.